good fucking god. <laughs> what? what the hell was that? All right. I think it's safe to say I have found the best margarita in all of Mexico. I don't even know the name of this place. I guess it is the Catch. And the Catch the Restaurant and Bar in Bacalar, Mexico. It is a Monday night here in the end times. It is Monday night, February 6, 2023, and I am completely fucking sideways. I am completely, totally fucking sideways in Bacala, Mexico. I have had two margaritas tonight. I've had dos margaritas. <laughs> Good fucking God. Ten dollars. Alright, I have some vague idea where I am. I have some vague idea where the fuck my new hotel room is. Oh, Jesus, we changed hotel rooms to get away from the goddamn music. Oh, Jesus, now I'm trying to remember where the fuck, where the fuck it is. So my buddy is teaching a geometry lesson. <laughs> he, my buddy lives in his left brain. He has no comprehension of what a right brain is. All right, we are in Bacalar. Bacalar, Mexico. Yes, so my buddy is teaching a class in geometry and I am staggering around drunk off my ass on a Monday night Somewhere in the central plaza of Bogalar Mayo. Should probably be finding some food right now. Oh god. I tell you. <laughs> there are more gorgeous women in Bacalar, Mexico than in any town its size on the planet. I'm fucking believable. The damn women in this town. Of course, I am invisible to them. I want to go check out the scene at Mr. Taco. Mr. Taco seems to be the. There's probably 200 restaurants in Bacalar, Mexico, and Mr. Taco. <laughs> Senor Taco is numero uno. All right. Okay, can I find my way to Mr. Taco if I don't get fucking run over? This is, good God, this is the second time I've been this drunk in a week. So I, I got this fucking shit faced a few nights ago and I ended up somehow don't ask me how it was completely innocent I ended up in the in the whorehouse one minute I was uh, somehow I found my I, I was literally literally I was out in the jungle I was uh, clawing my way through I, I lost the trail and somehow I got fucking lost out in the jungle. And I, I was literally ripping jungle vegetation out of my way, trying to find my way back to civilization. And, and like five minutes later, I was 
I found I stumbled into a fucking whorehouse. So I'm, I'm I stumble my way into the fucking whorehouse, and it and, and it's the fattest, ugliest women that I have ever seen in in Mexico. And it, you understand that Bacalar, Mexico, has the most gorgeous women of any place on the planet. So I I accidentally stumble into the fucking whorehouse. Look at this pedro. He's just lying in the middle of the road, and this car is. Let's watch the car. So the cars come down. And they just steer. You're in the you're in the middle of the road, amigo. Pero, you're in the middle of the road. You see the car? He's gonna run over you. And uh, it's these it's these fat, ugly fucking whores. And I <laughs> and all of the Mexicans are laughing at the gringo stumbling into the whorehouse by mistake. And I. And I stagger back out and I bump into the taxi driver and I tell him I came here looking for mermaids and all I find is whales. Alright. Good fucking God. Alright, here is the scene at Mr. Taco. Mr. Taco. <laughs> Mr. Taco is the number one most popular restaurant in all of Bacalar, Mexico. We have a scene at Mr. Taco. We have a major scene. Alright, how do I get in the Mr. Taco? I have never eaten at Mr. Taco. So, uh, <laughs> apparently, here is the line on a Monday night. It is a, this is, this is the line to get in to Mr. Taco in Bacalar, Mexico. Is Mr. Taco as good as they say it is? You're just having the drinks? I mean, I mean, look at the scene in Mr. Taco. <laughs> Are the drinks recommended here? Okay. I guess the drinks are recommended at Mr. Taco. Good fucking God. All right. It is a scene at Mr. Taco. Oh, Lord. All right. At some point, I'm going to have to. Good God Almighty. At some point, I'm going to have to uh, find out what all the excitement is about at Mr. Taco. What is your selection at Mr. Taco? Have you ever been here? You have been here. What did you, what did you get before? Uh, pastor. The pastor? That might be my recommendation. <laughs> Everything is good at Mr. Taco. Good. Fucking God. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> I have to get in line. The line is coming in from both directions. <laughs> this is, there are more people at Mr. Taco on a Monday night in Bacalar, Mexico. Then then all you, you take every restaurant in Bacalar, Mexico and combine them. Oh fuck. Oh, Jesus, what the hell was that? <laughs> oh, fuck. All right. Here we have another guy doing a, a YouTube video. All right, I've been here a couple of times. This is Restaurants Bar in Canto Bacalar. Enchanted Bacalar. Oh, God. So this place was fucking dead on Friday night. It's dead on Friday night. And the place is kicking ass on a, on a Monday night. Oh, Jesus. Oh, what are they doing here? So they have... Apparently ripped down the stage. Last time I was here at the stage, they were having this big uh, dance performance. They have completely torn down the old stage. 
and uh, so they were having this big dance performance and I went around to the back of the stage and all of the female dancers were uh, you know they were changing their costumes so I went around to the back of the stage and all of the dancers were uh, you know, changing their costumes and running around in their panties and bras. And uh, so I was behind the stage looking at all of the dancers in their panties. But I guess, uh, I guess we have a new stage. Oh, fuck. All right. <laughs> The Gringo Baracho is trying to find his hotel room. This is pretty much the okay, okay. Now I vaguely recognize the uh, neighborhood. This is where I was stumbling around this morning, looking for a fucking. Uh, I was looking for a fucking uh, pineapple juice. And then I gave up on the pineapple juice and decided to look for uh, decided to look uh, for a fucking bottle of water. All right, I'm taking the same walk. All right, I think I think my hotel is on this street. Oh Jesus. Oh, fuck. Lord. <laughs> what a difference two margaritas make. Of course, two margaritas in Mexico is like six fucking margaritas in Austin, Texas. All right. I guess I should pay attention to where the fuck I'm going and uh, stumble back to my hotel room. Oh, Jesus. Life. Life in the collapse of civilization. You know, this is the second collapse. So you got to understand where I'm walking, guys. I mean, all joking aside, this was the middle of the Mayan civilization, however many hundreds of years ago. So we've already had one collapse of civilization here. So this was right in the middle of, uh, <laughs> of the Mayan civilization. And... Uh, here we are on collapse number. Okay, here is the bakery. Ah, oh, fuck, I still have my second apple turnover from this morning. Oh, God, let's see what they've got uh, here tonight in the panaderia in the bakery. All right, so we got the, we got the Pedro Bravo, the Pedro Macho. He is guarding. All right. He's muy macho. Oh. He is a street dog. All right, let's look. This is the Pana de Rio where I found my apple turnovers this morning. Oh, oh man, they had the pecan pies. What the hell do you think that is? Look at that thing. Peor Cerrado at the moment. Peor Cerrado. 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 Las Diez. Oh man, amigo. Uh. <laughs> This is the of me, uh, Santa Primera. Oh, God. All right. 
Well, I'll have to come back here. I'm going to go have some uh, 15 peso tacos and then come back here to the... Uh, I'm going to pay 15... I'm going to get three tacos. So my, my drinks were 200. My dinner is going to be 50. And my dessert is going to be 75. So my... My dinner is going to be one fourth of my drinks, and my uh, <laughs> and my dessert is going to be one third of my drinks. Oh, fuck. Oh, man. All right, I think my hotel is somewhere. Ahead, and not get run over by this fucking motorcycle. Oh, Jesus, I cannot believe I'm back in Latin America. All right, I'm off to search for a 15 peso taco. Bye, guys.